always enjoy the journey, people. Always. Welcome back to the Mouse Diva channel and another haul. So this is a Hobby Lobby and hmm, Marshalls haul. It's a small one with some with a big punch at the end. Oh yes, wait till you see what's at the end. Let's just say, do you ever get surprised with yourself on something that you buy, like or something that you end up liking that? is not something that anybody would think you would like including yourself like it's not really your style but something about it called out to you well that's what happened to me so make sure to watch to the end okay so hobby lobby <sighs> if you watch my family channel life's a whirlwind you know that we love to travel and we're going to be doing even more, 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 more of it. Did you get the hint? Mm, mm, mm. Gosh, I suck. I am not a winker. Mm. Oh, there I go. There, that was better. Ah. Yeah, I'm not, and I'm not a pretty winker. Anyway. Okay, so, yeah. And you've seen a couple on our family channel um, of some RV tours that we've been on. We are RV hunting. Yes, we are. So, um, I'm not gonna go into details about it. I'm just gonna say we're RV hunting. And you can see more of that on that family channel. So go over there, make sure you subscribe and follow us on Instagram over there. Okay, I promised you some Ray Dunn, and I'm going to show you some Ray Dunn. I am extremely shocked at where I found this Ray Dunn. This was at Hobby Lobby. Oh, yes, people. Hobby Lobby has a whole thing of, like, utensils for Ray Dunn. Like, I was so shocked because, you know, we're just used to getting it at, like, Marshall's Home Goods and TJ Maxx. So, this is regular price $9.99, which I wouldn't pay $10 for these itty-bitty things. But, all their spring stuff, and for some reason this was considered a spring item, was 40% off. <clears throat> so, looks like a little miniature snow shovel, doesn't it? So, um, this was uh, $7.99, and they're saying that it, now that I'm looking at it, that it's a cookie turner, but I actually got this for Mr. Mouse Diva for his stocking as a pancake turner, because he makes big pancakes, and I thought that was, like, perfect, but I see they're calling it a cookie turner. Well, I guess if you made a big cookie, to me, it just looks like a miniature snow shovel. But here's the thing. Guess what? Today is Christmas Day. Yes, I am doing like my Christmas haul and an unboxing, all these videos. It's my video filming day now that all the festivities have ended for the day. Um, but his stocking was full. <laughs> so he's going to end up probably getting this for Valentine's Day. <laughs> Let's go back to the whole RV thing. They had at Hobby Lobby an entire little kitchen section of um, this style. So I thought, oh my gosh, I'm getting our first pot holder for basically our first kitchen item for our future RV um, now. Like, I was like, this is perfect. And why it's perfect is because I have been using the phrase, I'm a happy camper or I'm not a happy camper since I was a kid. So to see my phrase on here is like awesome. Now I would not pay, let's see. So $3.99, but it was 40% off. Okay, but it doesn't stop there. Because we also got two bowls with the whole RV theme going on. Um, regular price, $2.99. So we only got two because basically um, there, pro there may be three 
we may travel with Lakeland some, or I may travel with Lakeland and Skyland. You know, we, we really don't plan to travel with more than three people in the camper at a time. Maybe once every now and then four, but that would be it. Um, so we only really needed two bowls. Mr. Only, Steve looked at these and he said they're not microwavable, which is not a good thing, but you know, how could we resist? And of course, the matching plates. <laughs> yeah. We had to get the whole ma matching plates also. Okay, let's go back to Ray Dunn, shall we? Look at this! We have air fresheners. So there's three of them. And this is called, the scent is Citrus Summit. So let's actually, now that I'm home, open this and see what Citrus Summit summit actually smells like oh i didn't even notice this but on the very back of course it does say oh my gosh i can smell it already so it does say ray dunn so let's see gosh i haven't even got it totally open can't open it there we go oh wow oh wow okay citrus that smells really really good i'm really glad i chose this scent oh i forgot about this sticking in here Oh, so they had um, some stickers and find your own path and adventure awaits because we're going to be putting some stickers on our RV at some point. The places we travel will probably, um, I don't know yet if I'm going to stick them on the actual door of the RV or in the back or just somewhere just totally like irrelevant um i don't know but i really really liked these so because you know adventure does await us on our future travels i am so excited you guys you got to subscribe and follow us over there so you know what's going on and when that's going to happen okay ready right done like this was the only one left so this was 9.99 oh by the way i didn't realize that this um, this is Wilma, and actually a year ago, on Christmas Eve, uh, Ray Dunn lost Wilma. Uh, she passed away, but they got a new dog. Looks kind of similar. And Midge, I think, for some reason I got the word Midge in my mind, is the new puppy's name, I think. Anyway, so cheer. And I don't know what I'm going to use it for. <laughs> I'm always looking for storage solutions and this to our our bedroom is black furniture which I recommend never don't get black furniture people because as soon as you dust it you can't even tell it's you just not it. easy to keep black furniture cleaned like as soon as you clean it it's it's dusty again I've even taken like a half like vinegar water solution sprayed it on a rag and wiped the dust away and within no time the dust is back it's just impossible to keep clean don't recommend it okay so are you ready to see the big item again like I said at the beginning it is not my style but when I saw this in the store it just made me smile and I don't know what it was about it that made me smile I guess kind of the humor behind the actual painting and I didn't get it the first time. I actually posted it on my um, Insta story and was like, guys, I don't know why this makes me smile, but I think I like it. And I had people come back, you know, saying that, um, yeah, that it was just something, um, something about it that they could understand why. And, and one even said, oh, that's the kind of art that I like that had, it almost makes fun of like artwork. And it's actually in our living room. Now I am going to the frame I'm going to change because I think the frame needs to be more ornate. So I'm going to actually buy some more or like ornate trim and actually put it, fit it around the frame, like put it on top of the wood frame and then paint it. And I think it will make a huge difference. So it just depends on when I put this video up on whether you're gonna see that now or later. So in case you're not gonna see that at the end of this, um, that I haven't done it yet, then make sure you um, follow me on Instagram because you'll probably see it there. First. And this is it. 
this is what I just had to have that is normally like I don't know not something I would have not my style like not something that I would have got but something about the ornate frames and that chase lounge just or lounge chase whichever way you want to call it I I don't know it just called to me it's absolutely huge and I just oh my gosh I don't know I, I adore it my daughter Langley saw it and she's like oh, I want one of those but it just this he just makes me smile he does anyway um I think it was of course it was a half off or 40 percent off or ha no half their you know wall hangings were half off so I think it was like yeah, it was at least $30. Maybe it was $35. You know what? It might have been $35. It was somewhere between $30 and $35. Okay, guys. Let me know in the comments what was your favorite item. And check out my other Ray Dunn ha playlist because I'm addicted now and I can't stop buying it. Uh, <laughs> I did get some things for Christmas Ray Dunn. So check out that video. I may um, just go ahead and link it at the end. I'm not positive yet. I hope that 2021 is going to be wonderful for you, sending good vibes your way, and until the next time. There's a window